Muslim Zingana say they will not be discouraged by social distancing protocols as they kickstart the 2020 Ramadan fast amidst the scourge of the pandemic that is wreaking havoc across, across the globe. With mosques shut and congregational prayers, a key component of the Ramadan fast suspended, this year's Ramadan promises to be very different from what the faithful have been used to. My colleague Latif Idris has been speaking with Muslim families, some of whom are already appealing to government to open the mosque, especially during the last 10 days of the Ramadan fast. I'm moving from the first row of the Islamic Research Mosque in Nima. This mosque is arguably one of the biggest mosques in this neighborhood. On the first Friday of the month of Ramadan and on the first day of Ramadan 2020, this place would have been packed. But as you observe, the place is eerily quiet all because Muslims are observing the social distancing protocols announced by the president. Even as they observe one of the pillars of their religion. If things were normal, if we were in normal times, this place would have been packed with Muslims shoulder to shoulder in unison praying to Almighty Allah. But for many Muslims, as novel as the coronavirus is, so have they braced up for what would be an unusual Ramadan. We are in a difficult time of our lives. We cannot observe all these congregational prayers and all the blessings that come with coming together to pray and observe the Ramadan fast, praying together at midnight. All of that is not going to happen this year. The impact of the ban on congregational prayers would be felt during the Ramadan period, but the impact would even be greater during the last 10 days of Ramadan when Muslims have to do without a key component of the holy month, the tahajjud prayer, prayers observed at midnight. Some of them are appealing to authorities to lessen the restriction by opening up the mosques for those 10 days. <laughs> The last 10 days of Ramadan fast is when Muslims congregate at the mosque at midnight to say prayers to Almighty Allah. Uh, when that time comes, the appeal is that government should consider and open the mosques. But for the Mampusi chief of Greater Accra, the pandemic has not only derailed this year's Ramadan, but is disrupting the religion of Islam. It's not just derailing our way, way of worship or Islam. This, the whole world, everything is going down, is being reversed. And I know it is going to even take the world some time after coronavirus to re come back to its normal position. Look at our big powers. Look at what is happening in America. Look at what is happening in Italy. China, they are not coming out of it. And those people were the people we were looking to. It's day one of the 30 days fast, with the social distancing protocol still in force. And as it's being observed by Muslims the world over, many are hopeful that come the end of Ramadan, the pandemic would have ended.